Now in the last demonstration of me um, this to driving that windmill, that wind machine, I should say, um, because I was running on the shaft, it wore the stitching out. So um, we're just having to redo it all on my trusty singer this time. So I thought I'd just show you a little bit of this and then we'll go out and test it because it's a nice day. Just on that, on something. There we are. Right, I've got to go up here. And I've got to go to there, I think. Because I've got to be right on the edge of the... Yeah, I am. Just there. Got to get a line right on the edge. And then I'm just going across and across. Just do it a few times. There we are. And up this edge, like that. Luckily, it's uh, pretty flexible. This seatbelt is, so we can we can guide it and do what we need to sew it together. Hopefully, we'll see how we go. Anyway. And I've got to come across to here. So we keep going round with it. It doesn't matter. There we are. That'll do. There's a bit of baler band driving this machine, you know. Amazing its uses, isn't it? Right. Oh, hang on, I've pinned that to that now. I didn't want to do that, did I? Oh. No, we're all right. That's not on it. That's it. Right. Uh, I have blow. Sewn that to the seatbelt. We can deal with it anyway. We can deal with that. And then I'll just go across it a few more times. And then that'll do. Right, I've got the wheel on, bolted on, and I've got the belt there, look. And uh, we'll give it a whiz and see if it goes round. I've, uh, I've already <laughs> the joy of video it, eh? I've done all this once. Not that it matters, it's a lovely sunny day, it's an excuse to be out, isn't it? So, uh, I'm just going to give this a, a wind round and just see... If we can start it, and I was, I haven't got my camera stand, so I'm going to be holding the camera, so you'll have to put up with a bit of shaky video and a bit of um, handheld video for a change, eh? Well, it's all good fun, isn't it? It's all good fun. Right, let's see if I can pull this thing over compression. Yeah. Look at that. Started it one handed. How about that? Right. Now, we've got to see if we can get the seatbelt on without moving it. I may have to move it. It might be a little bit tight. So I've got some hands. Like that. I'm looking through the boot kinder. I'm watching the fingers and everything at the same time. Now it's on. Look at that, got it on. Can I pull it off here? Yeah. Right, it's on. It should be on. There we are. Right. Look at that. And with that fully, slightly eccentric, giving the belt a nice flap and that's what <laughs> the whole idea of having a long belt the flat belt is supposed to flap right and it is good so that's even better isn't it anyway as I say just a short bit on the end 
just to show you that my stitching's worked on the, you know, the old machine's done itself a favour again, so that's alright. But the main thing is, as usual, such a lovely day, we're, it's been very cool here for a day or two, and uh, it's now come, it's a little bit warm now, it's just right actually, it's coming quite warm for the weekend apparently, so we want to be outside. So it's just another excuse to be outside, that's all. Anyway, it works. <laughs> there we are. But I know, I know, I put these on the engine pages, you see. And I know they like to hear an engine room. What I might do is um, to, uh, with it being this lockdown nonsense and no shows, I might do like a minute video of this, just to start up and walk past, and then uh, ask the others if they want to do the same with their engines, one or two, and then I'll put them all together and have a virtual engine show. Anyway, anyone watching this or commenting in, on the comments, but I'll put I'll pop this on the on the page so you can see it. Just let us know what you think, and I'll be happy to do it. Right. There we are. Anyway, we're back in business, look. Now we'll have to get something else to drive it with, won't we? But uh, I might have something coming, you never know. We may have something coming. We'll see. Right. Nice day. Right. 